Are you torn between AMD RX 7900 XT and NVIDIA RTX 4070 T Super? Guess what? The 4070 is still the king of GPUs in its price range, and I can't wait to show you why it's totally worth the hype. Today, we're diving deep into their features, performance, pricing, and more to help you decide which GPU reigns supreme for your gaming or professional needs. But before we dive in, let me share something fun. My friends challenged me, claiming YouTube viewers are too lazy to subscribe or show support. Let's prove them wrong. Pause the video, smash that like button, and hit subscribe to show them what you're made of. Let's kick things off by exploring what each of these graphics cards has to offer. Positioned as top contenders for 4K gaming without breaking the bank, both cards promise high frame rates and robust performance. They differ in architecture, memory, and power efficiency, which makes this showdown even more interesting. Delving into performance details, the RX 7900 XT generally leads in rasterization performance. It shines in games optimized for AMD or where no specific optimizations for NVIDIA exist. Surprisingly, it also performs well in titles typically favoring NVIDIA, like Cyberpunk 2077. The RTX 4070T shows its strength in ray tracing capabilities, pulling ahead in titles that heavily utilize this technology, such as F1 2022. Enjoying the breakdown so far? Don't forget to like and subscribe for more tech insights and updates. When considering pricing and availability, the RX 7900 XT initially had a higher price tag but has seen reductions, making it generally more affordable than the RTX 4070T in many markets. This shift in pricing makes the RX 7900 XT a more tempting offer for those looking to maximize their budget. On the positive side, the RX 7900 XT offers superior 4K performance in rasterization and a better price-to-performance ratio, as prices have dropped. However, it's not all perfect. It lags behind in ray tracing performance compared to the RTX 4070T. For the RTX 4070T Super, Advantages include stronger performance in ray tracing and path-traced games. However, its higher price point with less frequent price drops can be a drawback for budget-conscious gamers. When compared to other high-end GPUs like the RTX 4080 or the older RTX 3080, both the RX 7900 XT and RTX 4070 T Super offer competitive performance for their price points. Each has unique strengths depending on game types and settings. The RX 7900 XT is ideal for gamers who want excellent 4K performance in rasterization at a better price point. It's suitable for those who can compromise on ray tracing performance. The RTX 4070 T Super, however, is better for users who prioritize high-quality ray tracing effects in their games and can justify the extra expense for that visual fidelity. If your focus is on getting the most out of 4K gaming with excellent raster performance and you're okay with good but not great ray tracing, the RX 7900 XT offers great value. However, if you're looking for the best ray tracing performance at this price range, the RTX 4070 T Super might be the way to go. Love what you're hearing. Smash that like button, subscribe